idiot. Good evening, everybody. What is up, Cody? John? Rico? This is my data. I can't remember how the fucking theme tune goes for Data Squad. Made it early. Oh my god. Welcome. Welcome. Praise Gazimon. Uh, so yes, uh, not only is it this week, it's today that Digimon Savers turns 15 years old. Happy anniversary to Savers. Uh, I would not be surprised if we see some kind of 15th anniversary IC Digivice this year, like we got for Tamers. A lot of people are saying, well, there's big Tamer celebration. Tamer's 15th didn't really have much, <laughs> so I wouldn't expect tons for Savers either. But you never know. Uh, Savers has an Agumon. Maybe we'll see some, some more 2006 Agumon merch. Uh, but today I am going to... <sighs> attempt to play some Digimon World Data Squad. Yeah, a re-release of the IC I think would be really good. Um, even if it's just the default one, just like... Masaru's one, I think that would be solid. Um, but yes, let me. I finally got another keyboard and mouse from my laptop so that I can run, you know, all kinds of games. Thanks for the follow. Some nice friend you got there, David. Thanks for the follow, Dean. Jesus, that's loud. Hold on, let me, uh, let me turn that down just a just a little touch. I really hate every other season beside Adventure. Yep. <laughs> Uh, turn my Xbox controller on as well. That'd be good. There's an adventure Agumon Dim. Data Squad Agumon Dim would be a really good idea, actually. I think that would make a ton of sense uh, to have the Geogram online, maybe some of the um, more unique kind of... Nice you got there, Thank you very much for the follow, Lena. Uh, some of the more unique uh, enemies from that series on that Dim. How many anniversaries are there this year? First Kamen Rider, then Super Sentai, now Digimon. Yeah, Digimon Tamers and Data Squad both turn... Well, Tamers is 20, Savers is 15. I'm pretty sure it's a reasonably... What is it, like, nine, uh, 19th anniversary of Frontier, obviously? Uh, yeah. So my orange IC, also my Vital Bracelet arrives. Nice, mine is still going. We're still going hardcore. Arrives tomorrow, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, without further ado, we should be able to jump straight into it. There it is. It's the power of timing your kids show releases when summer is starting, right, exactly. It's a lot of big anniversaries this year. Isn't Doctor Who coming up to the 60th soon? 65th, 60th, right? Yeah, 60th's gotta be coming soon next year. Hey, that's a mouse. I don't wanna see a mouse. This is a PS2 game. I'm playing this on original hardware, I swear. The game too quiet? Let me know if the audio is okay. When's our anniversary? When did you first follow me or subscribe to me? Oh, this FMV is scuffed. Oh no, what the fuck? That's not too bad, he's not too bad. Just the humans look scuffed. Just the humans look a little bit, mm-hmm. Oh, it does look like the reboot of Mew Tags, Mewtwo Strikes Back. <laughs> oh boy, happy anniversary, Savers. These look okay though. These, these uh, Digivolution sequences look all right. God damn. And for the furries. My BB is coming anywhere between Tuesday to Thursday. Nice, dude. Very epic and swag. There's Geogram. Data Squad is a cooler name than Savers. I don't disagree, actually. Data Squad's definitely more American cool, I guess. Savers, I don't know, feels a little bit more classy. Data Squad feels a little bit like in your face, kind of, kind of Ben 10 vibes to the name, you know. Uh oh, there he is. The deleter of... Oh, no, that's right. <laughs> I was going to say the deleter of, um, of Digimon, but that's Shine Greymon that does that. Savers is too similar to Tamers. Yeah, I can get that for sure. For sure. 
All right, and let's start a new game. What was the point of that? <laughs> what was the point of that little introductory? Okay. Begin Establishing dive. shot for no reason. Cool. Beginning digital dive. Trap. Activate digital harmonizer. I like that his voice acted. One through seven. Coordinate settings. Check. This is going to turn out to be that one Digimon game that I actually love. Hey, what's up, Psycho Red? Did they sense sensor Rosemon evolution here? I don't know. I haven't seen it in the game. They definitely did in, uh, in Data Squad. It becomes grindy. Ugh. Digimon Survive just released, please, so that we can all experience a Digimon game together. Arxis fighting game is getting wild. Is Melty Blood Arxis? Or is there something new Arxis that I don't know about? Are they doing Persona 5 Arena Ultimax? Really weirded out that Persona 5 Arena doesn't exist yet. There's, oh! <laughs> right. Okay. Right, let's get a treasure chest. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, I've come to you again. Yeah, it's okay for now. Walter Island. Alright. Camera in and out. Yes. Left and right, no. Those shadows uh, are not emulating correctly because they are a million miles away from where they should be. <laughs> I just don't understand why. Well, like, I don't think it's going to happen now. It's been too long, but I'm just confused as to why it didn't happen in the first place. Oh, we've got to fight an Otamamon? Cool. You've got a lot of nerve challenging. My blast to a fire. I forgot about Data Squad's Agumon voice. Yeah, I'm Agumon. That's pretty cool. Out, Agumon. Realize. Was Davis's shadow? Realize. I'm Boss's Digimon. I'm Agumon. I'm Agumon. That's yeah, pretty cool. And swag. Boss, I can handle this. I'll deal with you. <laughs> Let's do it, Agumon. Fighting time. Okay. Windmill those arms, homeboy. You got this. It's like a Bakugan character. Yeah, the voice is a uh, voice is a trip. Jesus Christ, can you chill, please? Fuck. Remember this game? Had it when I was a kid. Yeah, I, I think I uh, I missed the boat on this one. I have seen this intro before. I'm gonna try and get the boys together for a Digimon World for one-off stream at some point soon using Netplay. Looks like your Agumon is the one who can move the fastest. Fuck yeah, dude. I'm about to pepper spray. Pepper spray? <laughs> sure. More than two of the same command menu appear. That means he wants to use that one most. Right now he wants to use pepper breath more than sharp core. Okay. I'd do a pepper breath then, dude. It's kind of JRPG-ish, yeah. The world games became quite JRPG-ish though. Move <laughs> back his memory. I'm gonna swing my arms and if you get hit, it's your fault, right? they stuck with big bro instead of boss yeah anarchy they just said okay big bro maybe they didn't want kids to think that agumon was literally his little brother this is the only digimon world game you had that's wild i had world one and i think two and then maybe someone gave me a definitely legal copy of three for my definitely not chipped playstation i don't know if i ever actually played it I want to do All-Star Rumble again at some point because that game sucks so bad, but it's such a good stream game because you can just totally disengage brain and focus on chat. Oh, so I've got to buy the potato chips in your PlayStation because I was hungry and I had the tray open when I was looking for my Tekken 3 disc and I munched and crunched. Oh, I should do Tekken 3 arcade mode at some point, unlock all the characters. That would be phenomenal. That's one for a night after COVID. After we've all been uh, vaccinated, I'll get the boys over and we'll just take it in turns unlocking Tekken characters. Never owned a real console as a kid. I had World DS though. I had a bunch of consoles growing up. Tekken fight with Lambo? I could. We've both got Tekken 7, but he will absolutely wop the floor with me. Thanks for the house, Crimson Dragon Slayer. Could have just hit action, because he'll do that if that's the one he wants to do. Bazinga. 
Ripping piss, tadpole. Oh, he turned into an egg. Okay, sure. Yeah, you did great, Agamemnon. I'm so proud of you. You're my best friend. Man, you're gonna be friends forever, Agamemnon. He's a digi egg again. What's going on? We were attacked out of nowhere. It's weird that this is voice acting so much, man. There's something going on with the Digimon in the it's area. Very unusual, like. It looks like many of the Digimon have become. We fucking soldiers. killed him, Agumon. Why? We don't know. Cooperate with your Digimon partner. And see what's going on. Okay. Marcus, do you understand that you're in the digital world? It's yeah, Marcus, you idiot. No, do you know where you are, you fucking moron? I know. Well then, here's the dad's mission. I'm sending you the target Digimon. Oh, it's Tyromon. Tyromon, it's a champion Digimon. Tyromon? Tyromon. Okay. This isn't the money I've acted. Hey, what's up, Bat? Welcome. <laughs> It has already sunk several of them. Tyromon. Okay. Tyromon. I'll remember it. You shouldn't, because that's not his name. <laughs> You're going to make it a top 10 favorite Digimon video. I had an idea for a joke that would involve a clip of you saying something. Yeah, sure, man. Hit me up. So, you're saying we just have to find the bad Digimon and defeat them? Um, well, yes. Well, yes. <laughs> Tyromon is in a wild state. Be very careful. Your mum's in a wild state. Got Kamen Rider, Batroid, War, Gen Resist. Nice. Hey, what's up? B Skies? Is that how I'm saying that? Or B S K? Yes. Let me know how I'm pronouncing that or what you want to be called. Let me know. Welcome to your first stream. Hope you enjoy your stay. Come on, it's me you're talking. Hey, boss, I'm hungry now. Hey, I'm hungry too, bitch. You'll have to wait. I'm all warmed up. The difference between L and R is very hard for yeah. localized. Oh, yeah, for sure, but like. You could maybe look at what it's supposed to be and go, oh, maybe Tylosaur? Tylosaurus? No, no, I, I know all about L and R in Japan. I am not a newbie to Japanese stuff. That's not the issue. The issue is that it would be like if it was called Dinosaur Mon and it was called Dinosaur Mon. Like, you know what a dinosaur is. East Skies? Can nailed it. The L and R translation issue is very common. That's that's not the issue. The issue is that, like, take a second to maybe check what the the origin of the design of the Digimon is. <laughs> Kamen Rider Britta War. No. Gillian Jacobs from Community. Yeah, Gaborimon. Wow. Kuri Sarimon. That's one of my favorites. A and E X or Carl? Car oh, Carl! I see what you're doing now. Get fucked, Dimmon. I'm not paying forty dollars for your dim card. Get lost, idiot. So some of the Digimon in this game have their Japanese names. Everyone is called Yatagudamon. Yeah, Kurisarimon is like, come on, man. Like, I'm fine when you know they keep a very Japanese name. That's all good. Doesn't bother me in the slightest, right? Keep a Japanese name. Mugendramon. Fine. If you wanted to keep that. Kurisarimon. Really? Really? Oh. Ooh, Demi Devimon kind of looking purple today. Well, Tamamon kind of looked purple before as well, though, to be fair. I kind of like Baby Domon, though. Just because they were like, we don't want to write Baby D. We don't want to put baby D's all over our cards, so we're gonna say it's baby dumb on, and you're all gonna live with it, and I'm fine with that. Speaking of that, baby burner. This week, not watching Saber. Welcome to, um. Baby how many episodes is Saber in now? I don't watch Tokusatsu anymore. I haven't for like a year. What is it? 40 episodes in? I don't know. 30? Welcome to week 30 of me not watching Kamen Rider Saber. Or indulging in Tokusatsu at all. 28. Welcome to week 28 of me not watching Kamen Rider Saber. Hope you all enjoy your stay. Can I run faster? 
Nope, but I can fucking drown myself. Oh, and get encountered Seedramon? Wow, the... Oh, speak of the devil. Bobbly or Gabori? Which one are you gonna be? Gabori, of course you are. Hello, Gaborimon. Baby burner. Don't burn your babies, please. Oh no, it's him. Was that it? Cool. We got some Khan HP charge. I'm the best. I'm the best. How far can I go out to see? Not very far. Okay, good to know. That is pretty hardcore, dude. Agumon burning babies and shit? Can we cancel Agumon, please? Uh oh. Time to get burnt, baby. Hey, what's up, Daniel? Welcome to the stream. Are you burning babies all the time, dog? Chill. God damn, Agumon. Crazy for burning babies. I didn't even break a In front of they pronounced it Goblimon? Yeah. Baby Burner, what's up, Sal? Sal, you well? Yo, the, yeah, the emulation, um, I think it's because I forced it to 16 by 9. I don't know if you can see in the in the bottom right here. Uh, where's my mouse? But, like, I think that's Marcus' shadow. Um, <laughs> so... <laughs> Listen, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it too much. Uh, he's still got pepper breath. Agumon just prefers Baby Burner right now. This game is your childhood, and it was Dean's too. I think I was probably... Oh, 12 when this game came out? When did this game come out? Shadows aren't even real. It's true. It's true. Uh, Digimon World Data Squad PS2. Yeah. I was 13 years old when this game came out. Holy fuck. God damn, I'm so old. I'm so old. In my childhood, it was like Digimon Adventure, Zero Two, Tamers, and... I didn't play that many Digimon games. I've talked about this before. Um, Digimon World really put me off as a kid. I played it, but I never beat it. And then just kind of missed the boat on a lot of Digimon games going forward. About how old my audience is. Actually, I checked my analytics, and my average audience age is between 18 and 29. So, eat, eat, eat your farts, loser. <laughs> this game never came out in Europe. Well, that would make a lot of sense why I didn't play it. I was too busy playing Kingdom Hearts 2. I don't like some BS. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, look at that. Oh, damn. The random encounters are a little bit much. I'm your king. Or is Goblimon your king? I will be calling it Goblimon, by the way. I'll not be calling it Goblimon. Goblimon. Mmm. I don't mind the battle layout here either, actually. It's quite nice. Welcome, Mike. My Digimon World 3 is my first PS1 game and it had a bug where it would just crash. Yep. A lot of the Digimon World games are very buggy. Right up to... <clears throat> and including 4, I think? I expect the people have different opinions and everything, but I've seen so much hate on Saber and it's getting really tiring. For one, I don't get how some people are just actively hating on it, but it kind of annoys me. I, I muted everyone on Toku Twitter, so I haven't seen a single thing of that. Uh, I know people like to interact with people who like the same things as them, but I tell you for nothing, you will be infinitely happier if you just stop letting yourself see other people who like the things you like. <laughs> because, like, people are allowed to hate or dislike the things you like, and that's fine. And they will. Uh, and sometimes you just need to go, you know what? I do it with Digimon. I don't actively try and make a bunch of Digimon friends, not because Digimon people suck or anything, but because if you get deep in the trenches, you will start to hate the thing you love. It happened to me with Tokusatsu, big style. Not anyone's particular fault, it just happened. Um, oh yeah, I guess I will Digisoul charge. I think I love in Kamen Rider more than Digimon. I did for a while, but Kamen Rider got real stale real quick. Sometimes the tweet appears, I'm like, yeah, I mean, I just muted pretty much every every account and then also, like, words relating to Tokusatsu. I think I have Toku muted on Twitter. <laughs> oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. Just don't interact with anyone ever. Obviously, if you haven't got many friends, then try and make... What the fuck? What now? What just happened? Yeah. 
What just fucking happened? He slide evolved. Takato, I'm confused. Who is this guy? That was a good workout. I was like, okay, Geo Greymon time, and then Gilmon time. Apparently, what the fuck? Oh, hello, Xbox controller. My Xbox controller has been doing this a lot lately. It just randomly desyncs for a second. Uh, I noticed a while ago, Marco's videos what got me into Kamen Rider. My opinions and everything besides Hippokie are the complete opposite. And I mean, I think that's good as well. I think it's sometimes healthy to have respectful disagreements about things. It's when it just gets very, like, uh, aggressive. Take an easy bat. Never beat the first boss I didn't know what I was doing. That's the Galaxy Evolution System. Oh my god. I guess we got Gilmon for a while then. The Galaxy Brain Evolution System. I'm real low down in my chair. I'm gonna uh, try and sit up straight for a bit. What? Was that it? Oh my god. I guess rather than evolving linearly, it's like a nebula, a galaxy. Oh shit, monitor. Then back on, please, monitor. Monitor, there you are. Get a certain Digimon depending what you do in battle. That's, uh, that's a wild system right there. What am I doing? All right. Going the wrong way, apparently. Yeah, the random encounters are a lot. They are not, um, not giving you, oh, Gilmon versus Impmon. Truly, this is the Digimon Tamers video game I've been asking for. I wish they did more of this, though. I wish there was more, like, Digimon Zero to the game based on, like, like you know the Adventure PSP game? I wish they did those for more series. Tamers would be a great one. Do a, um, do, like, a Switch game based on Tamers. The story of Tamers is a video game. I'd be super down for that. Yeah, we do need more info on Survive. Hopefully, it's still spring until the end of June, I think, or the start of June, so... There's still time, baby! But time is uh, running out. What? Was that it? My time is running out. Didn't one really do be floating? He did be floating there. Press the triangle button on the map and the menu screen will be displayed. See how strong a Digimon is by sliding the status. Okay. Yeah, I found that out the hard way, Megumi. Right, I'm gonna go check out this map. Hey, what's up, Zenkai Pool? Right. Status. Oh man. Yeah, woo! Uh, okay. Oh. Evolution map. How are we doing? Right, what's happening? What's happening? New release of the Diarc would be very nice. Agumon Galaxy. Oh. Baby darling. Oh, what the fuck? This is crazy town. Dorumon. Raumon. What on earth is going on with this? Vimon? What the fuck? It is. It is Digisol here, like JP, for no reason. Play Agumon, clear Agumon. Okay. I'm just gonna just play the game. I'm not gonna try and fucking decipher that. Yeah, that's a little bit fucking crazy, huh, Soru? Does look like a Skyrim skill tree. Um, this game felt slow. I guess we'll find out. I'm not committing to a full LP of this or anything. Uh, HP charge. No, you're doing okay. You're doing okay since you did evolve, so you're all right for now. Oh, can I save? No. You can't save here. 
Battle drive. This needs the uh, crisis core. Um, initiating combat mode. Sharp claw. Spent two minutes getting my VB comfortably on and realized my Greymon's asleep. <laughs> I, uh, yeah. I'm heading towards, heading towards Metal Greymon. I should have Metal Greymon by tomorrow and then I can finally get to War Greymon and Metal Garurimon. And then hopefully finally get my Omnimon. It really a Digimon World game without the V-Pet stuff. Mom. It doesn't even seem to be overtly V-Pet this time though. It's just kind of like stats-based evolution, which I guess is kind of V-Pet. But it's in a weirdly different way. Like it seems to be a lot more just like, I don't know. VB will never ship at this point. Was it the P-Band I want? If so, we wait until May. Wild battle music sounds nice. Yeah, it's not too bad. Battle Tyranimon and Wild Seizuremon. But I was gonna go for Blitz and Crest, but they don't fucking jog rest to Alter S, so what's the fucking point? What's the, what, what in God's green earth is the point? Yeah, I deleted my Shivamon in the end. They, um, Ray was trying to find a way for me to do it, but I've got another Pulsemon, so it's not, it's not the worst. I will also always remember Shivamon fondly. Um, but you know, it means I can try for a Shroudmon now. Cause as well, Shivamon was scuffed because I didn't fully understand how the VB worked and stuff. I'm like, I should have done adventure mission a lot sooner. So uh, I'm gonna go for Shroudmon next time and he'll be my perma. I might even go for Kazuchimon, just get like the cannon line, you know? But I prefer Shroudmon to Kazuchimon anyway, so we'll see. I'm curious, if I bought another Agumon and Gabumon set, would I be able to get, would they count as individual dims? I kind of want to like keep Omnimon and then train a Blitz Greymon and uh, <clears throat> train a Blitz Greymon and a Quest Gururumon as well. Oh, if it's that Nin Nin game, I've heard a lot of people have been waiting for that to chip and it hasn't. Um, I didn't go through them in the end. I nearly went with them for a yellow BB, uh, but ended up canceling. I kind of want to get the yellow VB. Oh, speaking of VBs. I might be able to make someone. Thanks for the follow. Thank you very much, Zella. Uh, someone who wants a VB's life a little bit better soon. I'm going to try it. Fuck it. Let's see what happens. Masaru just punched the Tylermon. Yeah! Sorry, Marcus. Sorry. I love when he does that. I know it's a thing he does in Data Squad, but I wasn't expecting it in the game at all. But that would be like, whoa, too much for the kids. Twitch is hating me right now. I'm sorry. Grailmon? Geo Greymon. Okay. So he's the best goggle boy. I don't understand this galaxy brain shit at all, but I'm I'm here for it. I'm here for it. The game looks weird, rendered at like 1080 as well. Yeah, I know. I think Sori was being silly. I think everyone knows it's a goggle head. I'm really. Alright, do what you gotta do, Geo Greymon. Weirdly low poly models as well. I like the PS2. Flame breath! Flame breath! Hello, my name's Geo Greymon. Would you like to have fight and scrap with Aunt Beach? Hello. Would you like to have a go, you fucker? God damn, dude, you gotta stop. Leave me alone. I didn't do nothing to you. Flame breath. Not expecting that voice from Geo. I know, right? Flame breath. Hello, I am Geo Greymon. Would you like to buy a ShamWow or some kind of slap chop? I draw wave. Fuck him up, Geo Greymon. Flame Eat his breath. nan. Probably doing that attack power up thing, but. I like the mayor from Zootopia. 
haven't watched Zootopia since it came out. I'm Patch Alter S in the VB. That would be nice, but what they're probably going to do is sell you an Alter S fucking dim card knowing them. I did get a haircut, Baker. I'm like a fucking human man with normal length hair for the first time in like six months. We did it, boss. I'm feeling fra I've got the new Clearasil, which makes my skin go wicked, 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 wicked. I've confirmed the target Digimon has turned back into a Digi egg. Good job. You Looks beautiful. Be Thank you. You too. What do you think Games Journalist would rate this? Man, if I could consult with Games Journalist, I, uh... I honestly think you would say this is a great example of the video game industry. The only thing that it's lacking is microtransactions and paid DLC. But other than that, I think you'd rate it a sort of a 2 out of 10. Looking extra sexy. Thank you. I'm trying my best. I should have put something decent on. Not done in this area. In this area. Another Digimon has been detected. Uh oh. You're kidding. This can't be. It's fucking Obelisk Blue. No, I refuse. I've got Geo Greymon now. I'm hard as fucking nails. Something's coming. Something's coming. Me too. Huh? I mean, what? Uh oh, pathetic fallacy. Music's kind of fucky. I might use this for videos. I'm, I'm not hot. I didn't say I was hot. I just said I was coming. There's a difference. <laughs> oh, don't clip that. I got really excited early, but then I remembered the anime. I was excited for what ended last week. God damn. What's up, creepy mon? <laughs> oh, but wrong Digimon. You want a piece of me? Did Marcus's? Is... It looked like Marcus's like um, profile picture loaded in just the front part for a second, and the hair loaded in separately. But I might be wrong. You're, not so tough. Size doesn't matter when it comes to a You're a Geo Greymon. What's, what are you fucking on about? Battle Drive. Initiating combat mode. Uh-oh. Forgettios. I'm not going to be able to defeat this fucker at all. But we'll try our fucking best, won't we? Attack power up. Geo Grimon. Initiate. Can I lose this? Am I supposed to lose this? This feels like a battle I'm supposed to lose. Yeah. Uh, VB, VB enchant. I need to use a. Uh, I'm just gonna use the big one. Fuck it. What a bunch of Digimon Sabers boot like DVDs as a kid, and when I saw those Chessmon girls sporting <coughs> heavy cleavage in later episodes, I was like, "Wow, human boobas in my Digimon. <laughs> this is new." Yeah, Sabers was like, everyone says like Tamers is the most dark slash adult one. And it kind of is from like a plot perspective, but like punching Digimon and like sexy girls, like Savers was definitely okay. Yeah, you can't win that fight. I was gonna say, there's no way, dude. There's no way, dude. You can't make me fight Creepy Mon on my first time out, man. Ah, Dylan, what are you doing? Get to the dad center. Well, that was a weird Arnie, wasn't it? It was fine for a bit, and then the last word said sort of it's not over Swedish. Yet. If punch it, Marcus, you'll be fine. Go. Not me. Uh oh. The digi vote. That seems a little scuffy. It's fine. We'll we'll live. Demon looking thing. He looked at the Digivice? And he was like, yo, fuck that what? shit. Yoshino. Oh. Yoshino. Uh. Yeah, here she comes. Whoa, hey, here she comes. Hurt? Watch out, boy. She'll fuck you up. This is nothing. Even though your Digimon we is my least head favorite head partner head in Savers, I hate Lalamon. I'm Sunflowermon for that matter. I'll never forget that face. I'm gonna get him back for this. This is my dad. Oh my dad. Though the best modes for Rosemon and Ravemon are just lazy colors. Recolor at least they did something with Shine Greymon. Yeah, Ravemon or Ravemon and sorry, not Ravemon. <laughs> Ravemon and uh, Rosemon end up the loop. Yuma panting. Uh oh. Welcome to Yokohama Village. Yeah. <laughs> You can't escape. Yeah, idiot. Oh, that's actually Demi Devimon's voice. Nice. Help, Renamon! Help me, brother! Oh, 
Help me, brother! Help me, brother! What you gonna do when the power of Demi Devimon goes wild on you? Oh. Well, that's... that's something. Rippin' piss. Yuma? That's Renamon's voice actress from Tamers as well. Crazy. Probably from Savers or from Data Squad as well. I have them now. Humanity is currently. Friendship points are over 9,000! Oh, hey, what's up? Uh, Ken? What's his name? What do they call him in the dub? John Sampson? What's his fucking name? Kevin Sampson? The boundary between I don't the remember. Digital world and the real world. I don't know Yuma. I think she's an original character. The cause is unknown. At least Burst Rosemont looks better than Rosemont X. True. Richard Sampson. That's his fucking name. I knew he had some, like, white dad name. Richard Sampson. Oh, Rosemont has two wings instead of only one. Then that makes it pretty epic. You idiot. One wing is always cooler. Sephiroth and Genesis have established this. His name's Richard. How do you expect to be a member of DATS acting like that? Yoshino, tell us, what is DATS? Thought she was a game. It does make sense. Uh oh, here comes the YouTube subscribers. Digital Accident Tactics Squad. Yeah, that makes sense. We look at the arm that actually got a watch on it, eh? You good? Two more? Two more? Two more. Thank you, Streamlabs. Thank you very... And there it is. Thank you very much to all the YouTube subscribers. I appreciate you very much. Uh, duty is to police Digimon. The mysterious life forms in the digital world. What is Article 3, Clause 1 of the Digimon Treaty? Don't fuck the Digimon. You idiot! <laughs> Misty's the Digimon Masters, honestly, that's what it feels like. <laughs> I'm like, I've seen all these places before, not just in Savers, but also in Masters. Yeah, I had to put them on top of each other, because there's not enough space for all of them on that shelf in the line. So the ones that lie flat, I've got the ones that sit up on top of them. If I like, put a mic in the VB and you have to talk to your Digimon to help it grow like it's a plant, I would be like, Oh, good, you cool, little, little Greymon. You're my best friend! I've been talking to that motherfucker like I've got schizophrenia. I'll get fucking owned, dude. Get owned. Well, your injuries were serious, but it only took you three days to recover. You're tough as a roach. Is that supposed to be a compliment? Sheesh. Now here is your new mission. This time the target Digimon is Bakemon. Bak Bakemon. He enjoys tampering with data all around the world. And watching the people go into a panic. Okay. It seems he got running an ad. I will in a little bit, Assassin. I appreciate you. Thank you very much. Marcus, Yoshino, go to the digital world. Fuck off. Your mission Trying to get my end away. Fuck off back to digital world. Thank you, Assassin. I appreciate you. Yoshino's joined our team. Oh, legit. Like, actual party system. Was Kintorus on first move? already on his way regarding this matter. Rendezvous with him and work together on the mission. Bet. Why doesn't Thomas have to listen to the commander's briefing? Unlike you, Thomas has memorized oh, the Oh, get trip. owned, idiot. I see. The genius gets special treatment. That is how it works, yeah, in the world. Since the other day, many Digimon have supposedly become wild in the digital world. Your mom's become wild in the digital world. I'm concerned about that mysterious Digimon called Creepymon. Use extreme... Yeah, I'd be conf I'd be concerned about a Digimon called fucking Creepymon too. That darn Creepymon! I'm gonna. The Digimon Treaty is that meet. thing between like the Dat Center made up to the sort out by a on the world stuff world. between the digital world and the real world. I guess I don't know. I want to read this Digimon Treaty. Me too. Make some amendments. Like the no fucking Digimon. <laughs> Hey, Wi-Fi is back. Not much. We just got uh, Yoshino on the party. And now we're going into a forest in the digital world. Just realized I can add Shangrim on Rue most of the list of characters going berserk moment from shows I watched as a kid that probably are the reason I like that trope so much. I would presume Digimon get rights, yes. Listen, Marcus. Work together on this mission. 
don't need any help from Thomas. I'm not creepy, man. Sure is weird. I hope he isn't part of any major problems. Let's go, Agumon. Realize. Digimon realize. I'm gonna say the treaty does not permit Digimon human relations. It's certainly not carnal ones. Are you always this enthusiastic, boss? Yeah, creepy one is a little bit cringe, isn't it? Always. Yeah. It's like they called it Diaboromon specifically, so that because be, because Diablomon was a little bit too much, a little bit too close to the devil, a little bit too Lil Nas X for our liking here at Digimon Incorporated. We've got work to do. Let's go. Would it have killed them to texture the overworld devices? Now they cut the buff from the Elza Bubmon, yeah. Let's go, Lalamon. First, let's look for Thomas. I know, it's annoying. I'll have to play if I can find a way to fix the shadows. Not so bad once you're on the overworld, but it's just like it's a little weird. Am I back to Agumon now? Yeah, Lalamon does feel basic. Okay. So I can just become that whenever I want now? Pretty cool. I think. I oh, don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with regular Agumon for a minute. See what happens. Oh so can I not battle members there? Malamon. Ah, okay. That's interesting. Yeah, Lalamon and Sunflamon are not good. For me, at least. They're just a bit boring. I like shit versions of Palmon. Getting the Digimon Tame as Gacha Dims, whereas I save as Gacha Dims. They could be coming. It's just that. They, well, I, I would have shit. Oh. Hope that doesn't make me leave the area after the battle. Garurimon! Yeah, Palmon and Togemon are awesome. Oh no, I am Geogreymon, the fuck? Oh, wait, what? Whoa. Nuts, shoot. Fuck yeah, dude. Whoa. That's a lot. That's like way too much. Give me a gum one, damn. Yeah, I hope they do more of the adventure okay, Digimon, honestly. And like, if they're gonna do Vmon, I'd like a Wormmon one. Yeah, I mean, I figure it's gonna be a lot, but not that much a lot. I just got here, man. Oh, my cat's just some really stinky shit. In the Mega burst. I like he says manga verse. Oh, I guess I'm pretty strong too, huh? Get fucking dunked on, idiot. Like Lilimon more than Lilimon. Yeah, Lilimon, I don't mind too much. No. Everyone's a glass cannon, seems so. Really does seem so. Oh, hey, Salomon. I have the holy rings, that's why I know all about you. Me too. This is creepy. Jesus Christ, Yoshi. You know, calm down. Oh. Oh, whoa. That's kind of cool. Wow. Oh. This is one of the only Digimon, this is one of the only Digimon games you played with. More nice. Uh, no. Okay, interesting. I'm trying to get 20 eggs then. Let's see what happens. Ooh, two Gabumon and... Oh, Psychmon or Gabumon? Assuming Gabumon, they just look kind of purplish. Yeah, there's a Gabumon. I'm going to shoot them with my nuts. Eat my nuts, bitch man. That was a little slow, I'll be real with you. So, he's Flame in the back red. row. There's white part of his legs like boots with a different colored bottom or there's socks. I'll 
That's all you know. Uh, oh wait, on page you mean? Sorry, you mean on Garuda? Nut. Uh, this puppy looking Digimon is creepy. Thankfully, creepy not is here for us. Is there any particular reason that things like Gatamon and Makemon are champions about the size and strength of Rocky? I'm not entirely sure. I don't think so. Ultimately, I think it's just a, it's a quirk, right? So it was a quirk of Gatomon that she was this little holy Digimon that was a champion. The reason that then Makumon is like that is because Makumon is like basically evil ex antibody ish Gatomon, right? Mega burst. Um, I I don't really know. There probably is some stated reason that I don't I've forgotten about. Uh, but in general, general just seems to be a quirk, and they seem to try and basically act like she isn't a champion as often as possible they'll be like oh tail ring in zero two i guess she's the strength of a rookie now oh that's a shame shit! it's interesting how all the models in this game are closely modeled after the bandai artworks while the ds games are sprite based on the anime art mm. yeah it is interesting Was, so this is this a western only game or did this come out in japan first and this has been translated Hey, what's up, Jimpy or Jim Pie? What am I calling you? Welcome. Come oh, can we have Gatamon? We have Gatamon at home. Gatamon at home is Makumon. This was a Japanese game first. That makes a lot of sense. All right, I need to heal pretty badly. I see. Probably should have just used the KHP charge, but that's okay. Mikemon is Gatamon at home. I like Mikemon. Mikemon's underused. I should have probably used Mikemon instead of Mikemon. Battles in this are a lot. Oh, hey, Leomon. Guess what's gonna happen to you? Make him on Haters Unite for real. God damn, dude. Pokemon Battle Revolution vibes? Yeah, I haven't played Battle Revolution in a while, but I can kind of feel it. Came out about the same time. Eat my farts, Leomon. Mega Burst! Mega burst! Oh, dude. Yeah, absolutely ruined. Wait, no, you weren't ruined. Uh oh. Fist me, daddy. I mean, what? Something about BK Mon pisses you off. Shit. Shoot my nuts. Oh, yeah. That's how we do it in my garden. That what Geo Grimon sound like in the anime? I don't recall him sounding like that. I feel like he was more like Geo Grimon, a little bit like halfway between the original Grimon and that. But maybe I'm wrong. Recently got a red Digimon Tamers version three Digivice when I ordered it and had a, and a red version fifteenth Tamers Digivice. Didn't know that it was the twentieth anniversary. Well, they haven't announced the twentieth Digivice yet, so. You might have made the right choice. I w I have been holding off on buying a new D3, a uh, D-Arc, slash D-Power, just in case they announce something that's more affordable. Because the resale market on those things used is redonkulous. I would love to have more. I don't have more Digimon merch in general, but the stuff I like is Digivices, V-Pets, um, Zero Two stuff, but like specifically like Zero Two, the Digivolving figures that turn from the eggs into the figures. Uh, and yeah, the things I want are expensive. Mega burst. <laughs> yeah, aftermarket Digimon stuff sucks. It's a real shame. I shouldn't have wasted that Mega Burst on that Garurumon, but we live, we learn. Bought an anime figure, and I feel like one step closer to becoming full weeb. I've just never been into figures. I think for me, because when I want to collect stuff, I talked about this with Kamen Rider stuff. It's about like, um, I want to like pretend I'm in this show, right? I want to have like screen accurate Mega stuff. Burst. So Digivices are like, yeah, like that's a thing that's in the show. 
not so interested in like i like plush because they look good in the background but i'm not a big fan of them but again plush it's kind of like having a version of the digimon right kind of uh, but like figures and stuff i'm not super interested in i have got something coming soon which again i can't talk about right now i will but i can kind of talk about it it's a sponsored thing again um but i've got some stuff coming that's going to be interesting that i hope you guys enjoy and either this one was just so cheap for a show I'm watching that I decided to get it right. You can you can be a giant and put them in the jar. That's, that's true. Oh shit, we're about to die. I was not paying attention. Uh fucking oh. Uh oh. Okay, we're good. Created for the special edition Vital Brace was supposed to be available Tuesday. Velvet head back from the opponent's sand. Yeah. I eat two electric boogly. Maybe. Maybe. But this time, you guys get something even cooler. Well, one person does, at least. But I can't talk about it yet. Not till they rage. <clears throat> Lucky to get my V pets when they're still active. I have my USD3 and my D terminal AD power somewhere and jump base detector. Nice. I still have. Uh, those are my digivices there. I've got my 2021, my VPET 20th anniversary, my D3, and my D terminal. That's oh no, I've got a um, fusion fusion loader as well, but that's in like a box because I don't like it. Okay, KP charge, KHP charge, and. Oh. Never really think about spending a hundred pounds for a figure. Yeah, I just couldn't do it. Oh, interesting. That's kind of cool. I'm probably missing a ton of shit, but I don't really care. And the original Digimon I ever got was the D3. Yeah, I had the, not the Japanese version, obviously, the Bandai US slash UK uh, D3. I had the, that one and the Yoli one. Which was what? The color was Yoli. Pink? Purple? And the Japanese version of the Fusion Loader is the best version. Yeah, the, the Japanese Fusion Loader looked really good. I'd be really intrigued to get one of those. It's one of the few, like literally this and the VB are the only two that... Uh, it was red that Yoli had. Red, that's right. Um, it was that. The VB and the Fusion Loader are the only two with like color screens. I would, even if they don't do it for like, even if they don't do more VBs, I hope they do. Uh, just more V-Pets with full color screens would be great. Yeah. Any Digimon merch proper I ever bought with the Detector cards? I, I kind of want to get some of the Tamers. The cards that have the Tamers backs on them. I'm kind of tempted to go and get that 15th anniversary tin. Which is the tin that Takato has with all like the cards inside. And then maybe a 15th anniversary D arc. But man. That shit expensive. Oh, I should probably buy a, a new blue and red card off um, off that Etsy store, actually. But I'm going to do that right now. Doesn't the Fusion Loader have the gimmick where you can unlock Digimon with sound bites? The Japanese one or the English one? I put a tempered glass screen protector on my phone and now it won't fucking recognize my thumbprint. So they would do more Digimon clothes. I, yeah, I mean, I would never fit into them even when I lose a lot of weight because I'm a fucking huge motherfucker and they don't make those things in like four motherfucker sizes. What's up, Supreme Brawler? Welcome! Um, so I would struggle. Uh, Tamers, blue card, Etsy. I'll be back. Soon you'll see. You'll remember you belong to me. You'll be back. Time will tell. Why am I going into that? Japanese fusion load. Got you. Surprised they didn't release the 15th anniversary D terminal. That would be pretty cool. They fucking slept on Zero Two's 15th and 20th. It sucks, dude. It sucks. Um, sorry. I'm just. I'm just literally just on my stream buying shit that I don't need right now. Add to basket. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Literally. Is that going to show my address? No, we're good. I'm <laughs> literally just buying a blue card. 
<laughs> right now. Yeah, it's Chinocrafts. Yeah. <laughs> ah. Okay, let's keep going. I want to get the red card as well. Uh... <laughs> Tamer's red card. They always sleep on Henry. Yeah, dude, Henry's so good. I had Henry's D arc. I loved it. Absolutely loved it. Ooh, that's kind of cool, though. Ooh. There's some cool stuff on Etsy, man. The other cards that Chinook Crafts make? I'll have a look. This is the Khan Plays Digimon Savers and also looks at Chinook Crafts stuff. Do I just search Digimon or do I search cards? Oh, they do Wayfinders from Kingdom Hearts? That's cool. Ooh. Ooh. No. Oh, they do the gate cards from Adventure? That's pretty cool. Patamon's low poly model makes it look like he's got a halo sash. What? Davis' best protagonist proof he never causes Vmon into a dark digivolution. Exactly. Harry and Harry. Henry and Terriamon don't have gem statues? God damn, dude. Fuck's sake. I'm gonna look on. I really want um, the armor digi eggs, but the people that sell them, they're quite expensive and the 3D prints don't look great. They're not bad, but they've just got that very um, un, like, un, unfinished. I think you can like dip uh, 3, uh, 3D prints into like a sort of acid bath, basically, which kind of takes off some of that roughness. And a lot of people that are selling like armor digi eggs don't do it. And so I'm just like, oh, I don't think they're bad at all. Don't get me wrong. They're just like, Neh. oh, wild Lalamon? Okay. Oh no, wild Palamon. Okay, that makes sense. Um, yeah, there's still no one doing ones that I'd want to pay 40 quid for, plus like 20 quid tripping. Jesus Christ. Hey, if anyone 3D prints, uh, let me know. <laughs> I'd really like to get some really decent armor digi eggs. That would be great. Not transforming ones, just all the armor digi eggs in a nice finish with paint would be fucking killer. That would make me very happy. They would go there instead of the plush. Like, they probably look fine, the slightly not great ones. It's just the price, man. It's like, ugh. You know, it's obviously, it's not going to be that much more than materials, but it's like if I'm paying 40 quid for one digi egg, it's like, I'd at least like it to look. Favorite digi egg design? Uh, ooh, digi egg design versus favorite crest is tough. My favorite crest is the crest of kindness, but my favorite armor digi egg design. Oh, you got me over a barrel. I want to say friendship. I know it's weird, but I think I want to say friendship. Probably? Yeah, friendship or courage. Oh, no, 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 no. What am I talking about? Hope. Hope. Hope is my favorite design. Hope is awesome. Hope is awesome. Yeah, I don't... Yeah, so according to Sora, this didn't come out in Europe, so I guess I must never have played it as a kid. But I, I think I've tried to boot it up for a stream or something before. Because I'm familiar with it. Do you know sells versions of the blue and red cards that are recolored to match each tamer as well as the white one for Kalimon? Oh yeah? I know, uh... Like these Yanmamon. Mega Burst! Can we just search the Digimon? Seeing the option on the blue cards. All I'm seeing is the uh Yeah, sincerity is good too. I think I think light's good. Not a huge oh knowledge is really good too. Not a huge fan of reliability. Um Love's a little bit boring. Oh Metamon is a thing, but like people are treating it as if it's like gonna show up in other shit like it's not it's it's still digivolves from Roku show and meta you know like you're not gonna see omedamon show up in like a new season of the anime or anything probably saying that now something they definitely will 
Digi Egg of Miracles is good. Digi Egg of, um... The other one. <laughs> um... Oh my god, what's the other golden Digi Egg? The one that Rapid Mon Digivolves from. Uh... Da -da 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 -da. Destiny. Destiny. Uh, Digi Egg of Destiny is pretty solid, too. I feel like... Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Chat caught up. I feel like... It, I don't know, there's something about, like, like I want to, I really do like Miracles and Destiny, but, I'm going to be fake to the Japanese now. Um, I just feel like it's kind of, it's like saying your favorite Pokemon's Mewtwo or something. Like, it just feels like a very, like, oh, or like your favorite Digimon is Omnimon. It's like, okay, yeah, you like OP shit, we get it. And, like, I really do like Miracles and Destiny, but I feel like I'm being the kid that's like, no, 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 I had a force field, <laughs> you know? It's like you play fighting on the yard and it's like, no, no, I have fireballs and I'm immune to your fireballs. And I'm like, my favorite's Miracles. People are like, oh, okay. Oh, okay. You like Magnemon, we get it. Mm. Magnemon's super underrated. I keep forgetting about Magnemon. Because it feels just like off to the side. I'm always just like, yeah, yeah, Flame Dramon, Ray Dramon. Too bad they never use the Darkness Egg. Dude, they really fucking should have used those Dark Digimentals. All of them. Even the Poo one. Elementary school play fighting was real shit. I remember one day we used to do like like wizard battles or whatever the fuck with like different abilities, and we used to play Super Smash Brothers as well, where we just pretend to be like Mario or whatever. Um, and then one day I was like, "What if we, what if we played GTA?" And Layton was like, "Won't we get in trouble?" And I'm like, "Nah, if the teachers come, we'll just pretend to be playing Smash Brothers." <laughs> so we'd be walking around for them to be big smoke and shit. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta outrun the train, CJ. <laughs> no match for me. Yashimon's okay. It's not too bad. I think Vimon gets the best deal on um, on armor digivolutions that actually look like they're armor digivolutions, or at least look like they digivolve from Vimon. You have like even Kangaroomon. I fucking hate Kangaroomon, but it makes a ton of sense. And then you have, like, Mambomon, which is just dog shit. To the point where people prick themselves into thinking Mambomon is a digivolution of kindness. It's not. <laughs> Patamon with the Digi Egg of Light. You really couldn't do better than Mambomon. I'm sorry, Mambomon's not even a bad Digimon. But for that context, it sucks. I am the White Big Smoke. Most of the Digimon... No that, that won't betray my friends. Apart from all the time. Not even a good bit. Tell you want to look for his new file island. Oh, okay. I'll have a look. Mark, have you heard Shit, I should probably actually check out. Oh, uh, look at my face. That's me. Crazy. New file island. Oh. It added a space for no reason. Five children. The police are investigating. Oh yeah, look at that. That's pretty cool. Is it Digimon? That's pretty awesome, actually. I like that. Gajramon. Wow. That's why GCA, did you have a kid? Just close their eyes and pretend to be that blind guy. I don't think so. I think we mainly just pretended we had jetpacks and drove cars. What if a Zero C reboot had Dark Armor Digi Eggs? I'd definitely be down for that one. That'd be really cool. Ooh, someone's selling cool Diaboramon tokens. Ooh, that's cool. Shout out to Rapid Graphics. Oh, they're in the UK. Mm, nice. Maybe I will support them and buy a Diaboramon token. That's very cool. Possibly. I don't really run Diaboramon though, and I need a few of them. Okay, I need to open the gate on this. Excellent. I'll just see a 0 2 reboot with double armor digivolution. That would be cool too. Uh, I don't know if Mako's, Mako's crest was darkness. Uh, Mako Digimon crest. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if she actually had a crest, right? Did she? I don't think she actually has a crest. Mega burst! 
I don't think she has a crest. Yeah, never revealed anyway. She has the like X Digivice, which is, might, be, might be what you're thinking of. Like the, the evil Digivice, the gray Digivice. Yeah, she should stop sucking. Um, oh shit, I closed out of it. No, 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 I'll do that to you later. Local retro place has this, and I've been curious about it. Nice, what's up, Netkeeper? I have definitely legally, um, legally emulated this. Put the disc in my laptop, though, don't worry. Put the disc in my laptop, I'm just emulating through PCSX2. Because outputting through HDMI on a PS2 is super annoying, and I get to play with my Xbox controller now. Thank you, emulation, for the game I legally own. DNA X symbols on her digivice. Okay, I thought I already hit that. But I guess I did. Oh! That's what I was supposed to hit. No? Thanks for the follow, Kasai. Mako is a cutie, but like, I wish try never happened. That's for sure. Oh. What the fuck is this puzzle? I understand nothing. I am dumb. Oh. What? <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna keep going. I don't understand this game anymore. <laughs> Got distracted with Etsy. Red and blue make per Yeah, but I was confused as to what order. Like I hit blue like one time and then red one time. And then I got the purple thing, but I didn't understand why red suddenly opened the top one and not the bottom one all of a sudden. So I've actually had people tell me they hated Kizuna, but like try. Like I can understand hate and try and Kizuna. I hate a try and kind of had problems with Kizuna, but overall liked it. There are people that like try and hate Kizuna, and that's just wild to me. Really like Doraemon as a partner because there's so much I could do with it. Normal line to Doru, Doru Gurumon. Raptor Dramon is an armor, Grademon is a spirit evolution, Alpha Mon is bio merge, except it completely changed the colors of Raptor Dramon and Grademon because it kind of sucked, for real. Chip Tai and Mako, it's obvious that Tai had feelings for it in a try. Get you a girl, Tai! And that's the problem, is they, I'd rather they'd have committed to Mako and tried to make her good for, for Kizuna, like a really good character or something. Because like her just kind of like being in the background of Kizuna felt weird too. I don't know. I don't know. So uh, you got some splaining to do. This is, this is why I'm trepidatious about anything Tamers, whether it's a reboot, a sequel, uh, like a, an OVA, anything, has the potential to be fucking terrible. And now, to be fair, I'd rather a reboot. And people always say, why would you rather a reboot? You can't perfect the original. If they're going to do something that is potentially bad, I would rather it not take place in the same continuity as the thing I love. You know what Ghostbusters 2016 didn't do? retroactively ruin Ghostbusters. You know what a sequel to Tamers could do? Retroactively ruin Tamers. <laughs> Try is like real close for me. That's Evolution is such a great movie, but I wish we got more movies like Kizuna, for real, for real. And there are problems with Kizuna still. Want more original, si I would honestly take that. I would like something maybe like a tournament of champions kind of thing, like a, like a big silly Digimon movie where a bunch of tamers come back, like that one episode of Cross Wars. But I, I just, I don't want big canonical sequels that fuck things up because that is way worse to me than a reboot. I love Super Tamers reboot that actually commits to card slash me too. I think they could use the new card game. Uh, the new card game wouldn't lend itself very well to tamers actually, if you wanted to do card slash because a lot of the options aren't really they're a lot more nebulous like some of them are like attacks from digimon but more of them are like let's stop fighting and stuff like that so i think you might have to use an original card system because i do love the idea of like andromon's wings being put on gilmon and stuff i wish they did more of that 
Um, that was like a really unique concept that I think got kind of thrown to the wayside. So I'd like a season, maybe not even Taylor's, just a new season that's like, because it would be a great toy line as well, I think, because you could have figures that would have uh, kind of like Zord Builder, I guess, from Power Rangers, where it's like, there's a lot of universal pegs and holes. Universal pegs and holes, sound, sound, uh, title on a text tape. And you could like put wings onto the back of any Digimon or take their arms off and like augment, you know, like any any stage Digimon with, uh, with like a Metal Greymon arm or whatever. Been a while, but isn't the last time they used anything besides Evolution during BLs? But I don't know. I need to rewatch Tamers because I've got this video that I keep putting off that I need to be up on my Tamers knowledge. Could each Tamer have the ability to swipe a blank Tamer card in which they give effects based on what their game counterpart card does? Yeah, that's that's possible. It's not so much the images; it's more that it's like it wouldn't be the same. Digimodify wouldn't be the same if you based it on the effects of the card game in 2020 because, like, Digimodify was about modifying the Digimon, right? Making them faster, giving them wings, giving them a shield, whatever the fuck it may have been. Like, training gloves, whatever it was. They don't really have those items in 2020. It's like, some of them will be, like, you know, Victory Ray or whatever, but a lot of them will just be, like... You know, looking back on the good times and stuff like that. <laughs> Unite your heart. Jogress DNA Digivolution now. And it's like, that's not really... Not really the same sort of thing. The only thing you could do would be to, like, give everything an equivalent. So, like, if you use... Patamon's Confession, you get, like... I don't know, like an aura of hope or something, you know? It would have to be more nebulous and more like kind of disconnected, I guess. This music sounds like something. Mega burst. Sounds like a real pop song and I can't put my finger on it. I think uh, if I can get to a place that I'm not stuck at. Nebulous is one of my favorite words because I think it conveys how a lot of things are and that is like floating around, woozy wazzy, you know, just not tied together fully. Dude, the random encounters in this game fucking suck. It is way too often on underscore nebulous mood. I'm very nebulous. Mega burst. The character models are not great for for mid life cycle PS2. The, the PRG end of life cycle, kind of, not end of life cycle, but PS3 and the Wii were out by, this, by the time this game came out, you know? PS2 was capable of more than this. Yeah. I like the Frontier reboot just to see if they can fix the later half. Yeah, I feel like Frontier will say, honestly, I just, I'm just kind of tired of reboots. Like, I know they're more marketable to do stuff based on old franchises and the past two fresh starts they tried, Cross Wars and Atmon did dog shit, but I'd like an original series, you know. Play models may have low polys, but Geogramon do got that foot size. Yeah, the encounter. This one feels especially egregious, though. I've played a few Digimon games on stream now, and it's like. You load Black Roar and Shadow Howl. You can get Omnimon's Wart, yes. You can't get uh, Alter B, though. Which is a shame. You can get Wart. This came out after Rumble Arena 2, and it looks a lot better. I don't know, man. I feel like Rumble Arena 2. <sighs> Maybe it's because you're further away from the model. Like, it doesn't look bad, don't get me wrong, but like, you know. Metal Gear Solid 4 came out when this game came out, I think. Was it the year after? I mean, not on the PS2, obviously, but Metal Gear Solid 4. It's not a ter it doesn't look terrible, don't get me wrong, but like, you could have made better models. I know, Metal and yes, was 2008. No one made a Pokemon Sword and Shield drag. That's because my audience is elite. No one actually plays Pokemon here anymore. I wanted mom's cooking. Wasn't Dragon Quest 8 out? Probably. I've never played a Dragon Quest game, fun fact. Okay. 
Before I die trying to fuck you, baby. Ah, that's where the purple is. Okay. Pokemon stupid, it's just zoology for people who don't shower. <laughs> Pokemon slander, yes, we love to see it. Yeah, if it ain't Johto, it's a no toe from me, baby. I want to get into Dragon Quest, it's just I don't think it was ever very popular in the UK. Um, in comparison to Final Fantasy, which was a killer app or a killer IP. Mega burst. Did YouTube just fucking recommend me a video of monks reacting to Mr. Beast? Oh god, the algorithm. Algae Rhythm, Star of Space Jam. I hate, can I, I don't, no one cares probably, but I fucking hate what they're doing with the new Space Jam. It sucks. I mean, I'm hoping that it'll be different to what it seems to be, but the idea of it like all being a computer simulation fucking sucks, dude. <laughs> fucking sucks. I want to commit. If you're going to do fucking Looney Tunes and basketball players, you've got to fucking commit to like the looney tunes dimension and the beeble dimension and all that shit you can't be like no no it's not really bugs bunny it's just a, it's just a computer you shut the fuck up fuck out of here with war machine the fucking ai war machine siri was that it real real fucking i was gonna say donald duck real bugs bunny with real lebron james making real fucking basketball against the monsters don't fuck around. I don't know why I'm so... It has to fit in with basketball canon. You can't have it be that Michael Jordan actually met the Looney Tunes and then 20 years on or whatever, 25 years on, in a canonical sequel be like, oh, that's too crazy. No, that's crazy. No, no. We're just going to have it be a computer program now. Fuck you. Fuck you. Who are those two twins that were famous in the early 2000s? Uh, Mary-Kate and Ashley Olsen? Was Bing Chungus in Space Jam 2? Uh, he is going to be in that Looney Tunes game now. If, if Big Chungus is probably going to show up in the in Space Jam 2 in the background, and people are going to go, Oh my god, Big Chungus! <laughs> Mega burst. Zack and Cody? Oh, it might have been Zack and Cody. I'm old, see, I'm thinking, I'm thinking Mary-Kate and Ashley. Didn't Dylan and Cole promote Pokemon as well? Wasn't the Sprouses? What other twins were there? Like Mini Ant and Deck? <laughs> uh, I know that Girls Aloud promoted the Nintendo DS and Nintendogs at one point. Looney Tunes are digital, then his big chung as a Digimon. Stop it. Delete your comment, please. I don't respect that. Hi, Phoenix Mon. I'm going to sit up straight now. Oh my lord. Those adult twins who were on X Factor Gemini? Yeah, that's the one that got you banned. Look what you did. Mega Look what you did to yourself. Are you proud of yourself now? I like. Ooh. Oh. Maya and Mina. Oh, Jedward! Oh my god, of course, Jedward. Jan and Edward. Rich Edward. Really chungus of me? I know, dude. I'm quite the chungus. When I wanna be. Chungus mom. Sprouse twins did indeed promote Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Phenomenal. Tia and Tamara. Okay. I've gotta find a way out of this fucking forest. Hey, what's up, Wally? I'm doing good. How are you? Welcome to the stream. This game is tiring. But we're gonna get through it. I should probably have gotten another drink, so I'm probably gonna run an ad in a second to go grab one and have a little pee-pee. I'm with the HGSS ad very clearly, but I think I've blocked Jedward out of my memories. You can never forget John and Edward, Crimson Dragon Slayer. They're your favorite. Oh, sister, sister. Okay, that sounds familiar. You love Jedward. Jedward loves you. For John and Edward. Jedward. They shaved their hair off recently for charity, so. Hi, Playboys. 
Fair play for shaving off the one thing people remember about you, like, GG. That's not fucking... Top of the morning to you, laddies! Jacksepticeye! Day's about to start right now. Time zones are crazy. I appreciate you. Hope your day goes well. I'm, uh, I'm gonna try and get to a place where I don't feel like I'm gonna get lost, and then try and go for a quick break. Oh, no. Oh, no. I went back to the big... Go back to the big... I am on Instagram, but I never use it. I haven't used it in like six months. I think I do have, I think my Instagram account's still alive. Hey, so guess what? I'm gonna BRB for 30 seconds to a minute uh, because fuck, go get a drink and a, and a quick, well, a piss and then a hand wash and then a drink. I am on OnlyFans, yep. Find me on OnlyFans at um, Trisha Paytas. I'll, I'll BRB, enjoy the advert if you get one. To me, oh death, come close my eyes, whoa, I know, I'm more fool than wise, she said to me, oh death, it's way too wet on your cheeks to be nothing, but what does she know? Welcome back, everybody. Hello. It's me, Khan, the streamer. Live on twitch.tv forward slash Khan underscore EX. Thank you for the follow, Phantom Desklops. Level as a warp point you have to use in order to get to the final battle. Yep. Now I've got to try and find a way back to the fucking purple area. I am the X streamer. I don't really stream anymore, man. YouTube's so busy. I'm, like, constantly having to work on YouTube stuff. Um... Wish I was making enough to hire an editor fully. If I could get an editor, it would be cash money. And things are getting, we're getting there. We're, get, we're, we're getting there. X as in the EX. No, no, no. Let's go with X streamer. I'll just put a nail in the coffin. Thousand followers is enough for me, thanks. Lullaby! <laughs> Lullaby! music reminds me of something but i can't think what it is man do my head in if you did a play through this game you could upload to your youtube series well yeah i mean i'd be tempted i might start doing this more often it doesn't seem particularly difficult but it's just stream tax you like paying attention to chat and then i'm like what am i doing again what's happening but yeah i might do this more often hey that's my line i want to get back to um the translation of Tag tamers as well, but I just can't seem to work out what you're supposed to do at a certain point in that game. So I'm just gonna have to go through it on my own time and be like, okay, maybe get a walkthrough up, you know. I probably wouldn't upload it to my main channel though. It'll go up on the second channel. I just wish oh god. Just wish I could get through more than like half a screen without these random encounters. This is why, you know, God love it for all its faults. The grass idea in Pokemon is Kino. Like, I go back and play some older JRPGs, like Final Fantasy 1, for example. Holy shit. Mega Burst! Or games that let you skip encounters with items. Oh, baby. Final Fantasy 10 2 has got an earring, I think. 
that stops random encounters. Oh, oh god. Fuck it up, baby. Before I die, trying to fuck you, baby. Hey, Garurumon, eat my farts. Nuts gun, bitch. Eat my nuts gun. I do like the system of like the move your Digimon most wants to do. I think that's an interesting idea. For sure. Is that it? Is that it? Pretty cringe, bro. Alright, so we gotta go try to turn the gate to purple. Can I just run? I like a quick run button. Everything takes so long as well. Can't escape. Cool. Epic, dude. <clears throat> I love video games. They're my favorite things in the world. Can you escape? There's no escape! Nope, sure can't. Digivolve, though. Alright, sure. Digisoul Charge! So badly when I start streaming on free time. Streaming's weird, man. I uh, I don't think I could have started doing it without like an established audience. Because I am so like not self-conscious, but just like, oh god, I hope people enjoy this, I hope people are watching. And like people who can just stream to no viewers. Like I don't mean this in a condescending way. I know it sounds condescending when I say it. I don't mean it. It is the exact opposite. Um it is just like fuck me like i i don't know like i'm always in like making a little making a product like making like like making like a show i'm trying to give a show in everything i do and it's like no you can just totally turn on the camera and play league of legends for nine hours and if no one watches that's fine and i'm just like that's a thing you can do i don't have to be on my sir just killed a palmon he's he's good like that also, I didn't digivolve. That's strange. No. No, it's just all nuts. All nuts all the time, baby. Oh, I wish I could speed up battles or something. I sent him to sleep and killed him. That's kind of OP, dude. I'm gonna make Masaru punch a Palmon again. Fuck it. Let's go. How about this? <laughs> it's so good. Yeah! It's so good. Did you soul charge? Yeah. Get my on back. Yeah, oh, for sure. Yeah, I recommend it to everyone. If you can stream or make it, even if it's like a shitty two minute video, just keep making shit. Keep making shit. Keep doing it. Didn't digital from the punch room. Mark, Mark did enough damage to turn the palm on back into a this galaxy shit is fucking stupid weird. Okay, sure. Sure, man. And then if I do it again, I'm just so curious by this whole thing now. How about that? I'm genuinely so curious by all of this. I need to turn into an X, so it's not gonna happen. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. My internet is awful too, so I think that what I'm gonna start doing is recording long plays. Yeah, that could be fun. Those were on some weird shit when they made this galaxy thing, for real. No, no I'm not upset about Vimon. I'm just, it's like, I'm gonna digivolve. Oh no, I'm gonna de digivolve? Okay. Sure. Okay, it's down here. Uh... No, I don't like it. Let me run away, please. Please, Dad. Let me escape, you fuck. Okay, fine. It is a weird system, Blaze. You were right. You were right. It is truly galaxy brained. Good night. 
Oh, my Xbox controller did the off thing again. I'm streaming really hard because either just no one watching or one person. Yeah, it's weird. And like when, like obviously I found Digimon, it's like Digimon games do really well, but then I want to stream other stuff and like not many people watch and it's just like, man. Yeah, I'm, I, I kind of want to like level up Vmon if I can. I don't know if I did that or I'm going to go back to Geogramon now, I guess. No, I got Groundmon. Okay, sure. I'll take it. That's fine. I'm a-okay I'm -A -okay with Groundmon. Let's go. Let's go, baby. I would really like to Digivolve Lalamon at some point if I could. But maybe I just don't get that choice. Look at a guide for evolution, but your Digimon could be super into aggro or wanting to guard and you don't want to need to. Yeah, for sure. I think I'm happy to just let it be random. I'm not too asked. This is a, this is like a blind playthrough. I like that experience, and I can understand why it might be frustrating if people have played the game before. But I think to me, it's most rewarding and most. I'm not gonna learn a game if a guide tells me what to do the whole time because I'm just gonna follow the guide and not retain any information. I like making mistakes and being like, I'm just gonna do what happens. I'm just gonna let what happens happen. And I think that's why I'm interested in Survive, because everyone will be experiencing it for the first time. Whereas a lot of these games, a lot of people have already played to death, and that's kind of annoying for me. Not annoying for me, but like, it, it diminishes the experience when I want to be like, look at this dumb game that I've never played before that's silly. And everyone's like, no, actually, if you do this, and you do this, and you do this. <laughs> it's with Survive, we can all just be like, thanks for the follow, Caspian. I was just talking with no one watching, I'd rather just be recording. Right, exactly. Yeah, it's it's a strange one. Making content in general is very weird. Uh, like not knowing what audience, if any, there's gonna be and stuff. Just about making it though, man. You know, people people busk on the streets to no one or to everyone. You just gotta wait and see. Thank you very much for the follow, Caspian, I appreciate you. Right. Some more liquid, or else I'm going to die of dehydration. Before I die, trying to fuck you, baby. Why have I got that song stuck in my head? And hopefully, we will have no babies. Good game shouldn't need you to game the system in order to win. I don't disagree. I don't disagree. I think you should feel like. I, I feel like any game. But the conclusion is like you need to have a guide to beat this kind of failed not on like hard difficulty or a hundred percent or anything like that but i feel like if i can't just play your game and get immersed without someone else someone else's guide telling me how to beat the game then it's not a good game <laughs> like fundamentally like, you can, you can get through a Dark Souls, right? By kind of bullshitting around. Like a sweat. God, like weeks ago? Oh, good! Nice! I mean, they gave you the Uber, the Uber text arrived eventually. Generic big streamer advice would be entertaining people will watch. It, it's true to an extent, but also the thing that no one wants to admit uh, is that online shit is just fucking luck, man. It's just fucking luck. And if you make good shit, your luck is more likely to work out. But how did I even activate the purple thing before? Like, it is just luck. The algorithm just favors you one day. I made content online for ages, right? And then I did some fucking stupid Kamen Rider shit, or some Power Rangers shit, randomly took off. The channel died because I fucking hated that shit, did some random Digimon shit that wasn't even fact-checked, randomly blew up three months later. You just never know. The people that like, just make good stuff. It's like, yeah, you could make good stuff. You could always try and push yourself and do better. But also there are people who make the most wonderful, like, stop-motion shit and like, amazingly animated shit that get like, 
20 views because they're just not getting the big push they need. Uh, nepotism and luck are bigger than anything else and being attractive helps a fucking bunch too, apparently. Fuck fundamentals, I love playing janky RPGs that are barely playable. Right, and I'm, like, I'm down for that, for sure. Um, but like... It, it shouldn't be like, you need to play this game. Like, oh, you just play with the guide. It was like, no, then I'm not going to play the game because the game has failed. Uh, do, 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 if Tames didn't have Biomage, what color card do you think they could use to reach Mega Level? Ooh. Blue, red. Maybe gold would make sense with Takato's gold Digivice, right? There's also the fact that if a live streamer happens to see you and point their followers to you, suddenly get an influx. I mean, you will get an influx for that raid. Uh, I have experience of like two or three. M most notably, the Deckard Games raid, which was awesome, don't get me wrong. Uh, I still have a lot of followers from that. What you will find is unless you are pretty much exactly the same type of content creator as that person and doing the same types of games, uh, that fall off is going to be real quick. The coolest thing about the Deckard raid, Deckard raid was like, oh my god, look at all these people. And the worst thing about the Deckard raid was over the course of the next month, watching most of those people that followed unfollow, or at least not be active in the streams. <laughs> It's great for a minute, and you might be able to build momentum off it, for sure. I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. My group channel just randomly got a bunch of views for the Terraria Hardcore series got shared in a Hardcore Discord. It's just how it goes sometimes, you know? No, it's not, that I, it's not that I don't want to use guides. It's that if... Oh, you... Well, you know, like, if I start playing Digimon World, and I'm bad at it, right? And like, not just because I suck, because the game is difficult. The, oh, well, you should be using a guide logic is like, yeah, I probably will use a guide, but that shouldn't just be acceptable. That shouldn't just be like, oh well, yeah, this game's just shit and you need a guide for it. It's like, it's a bad game. But no, again, if the game if the game has a guide, that's fine. That's, that's the whole thing. If it's got a little like, you know, how to play or whatever, that's fine. Any supplementary material is fine. It's when a game releases and then someone else's guide or the Brady Games guide or whatever the fuck it may be is like that. Well, you need that if you actually want to play the game. Then no, I will not play your game. Fuck you. Like, I only want to use a guide when necessary. Exactly. And I don't want the game to be to a excruciating level of painful without the guide telling me do this, then do this, then do this. Because that's not fun then. I may as well just watch a let's play. I, I don't understand the point of like, jank is hilarious. When jank is funny and like, ah, I love this jank. You know, David Cage jank, great. Greatest jank in the world. When a game is just like intolerable, I'm not a big fan. Right, I mean, again, I, I fundamentally am different to that. I like trying to find how as much as I can find. The first time I play a video game, I don't want to be told, go and do this, do that, because then I'm not enjoying it and immersing myself. If I beat Persona 5 or Final Fantasy 7 Remake, then I will do New Game Plus, or I will do a new game if they don't have a New Game Plus, and then I will get a guide out and be like, okay, where's the all the items I need. Where's this and where's that? But the first time I play a game, I feel like it's like the equivalent of buying a book and then watching a five minute explanation. It's like, well, why did I, thanks for the follow thousand. Why did I buy the guy? Why did I buy the book? Why didn't I just read the, read the explanation, you know? Why didn't I read the Wikipedia? It's like buying a book and then reading the wiki article or reading the thing that tells you how to feel. I'm just like, well, I didn't get into the game then, did I? The second time around, absolutely. Guides are great. Um, but like, oh, you're gonna want a guide before you play this game. It's just like... Assume knowledge. Deck editing Digimon decks right now? Nice. Got lost in the forest? Yeah, I'm already struggling. I, I don't understand what I'm supposed to do here. I am truly lost. Oh, this is new. I know it's not. How do I get down to there? I, I unlocked the purple before, and I don't know how I fucking did it. 
The only guided thing I use for Persona games is just which dialogue to choose for the social points. After my third playthrough of P5. Yeah, I mean, I get, if you personally make that decision that you want the best run, that's fine. I think I think I'm just I have umbrage with the Oh well this game only is worth it, like you should only play this with a guide, so okay I won't play it then. Local card shop finally got Digimon cards. Nice, that's awesome. That is awesome. I hope I can get some cards into hands of people that want to play. I'm hoping my LGS will get 1.5. I already managed to get two 1.5s this month, so hopefully my LGS will get more 1.5 and I can get a couple of boxes off them. I think I told them I wanted two or three, so I'm probably gonna end up with a bunch of 1.5. Also saving for that PS5 because Intergrade comes out in June, so I have to get a PS5 by the end of May. Put a Digimon Bolt for six hundred dollars. Oh wait, is it one point zero and one point five bulk? Lovely. Make that money. I'm probably going to end up selling off some stuff as well, just because it's just like, so much of it. I want to give away a few, a fair few. Uh, oh. I'm going to basically try and build a playable deck of each color. And then keep one of everything in my binder. And then from there, just get rid of and sell the rest. Finally, go. New Vanguard stuff, nice. I'm hoping Digimon gets better this summer. Drop with the Reaper? What do you mean? To sell, you mean? I would waiting for a Reaper to sell be better. I mean, I'm going to because I'm not trying to scalp anyone. You mean prices of the boxes will go down? Not for me, they won't because my LGS sells at RRP. I don't buy scalper prices or even inflated prices. I refuse to do it. English VB app is possible. Don't buy at the stupid inflated prices. If you do that, you're a mug. Um. Oh no, dude, I pre-ordered a bunch of shit. Problem is it didn't fucking show up. <laughs> I pre-ordered, I got the November pre-order, I got the uh so I pre-ordered for November. I pre-ordered for what March? February? Whenever 1.0 came out? And I pre-ordered for the supposed 1.5 drop. Uh, I got the November one, no problem. That arrived at my LGS on, re on the day before release day. All good. Everything since then, basically since Brexit, which has fucked up a lot of shit in the UK, uh, nothing has arrived on time. My LGS got 1.0 two weeks ago, three weeks ago. My They haven't had 1.5 yet. I managed to put in pre-orders as well orders with some other places that had overstock um but yeah like the, it's it's not even like pre-order and you'll get your cards in the uk uh like it is pre-ordered a year ago good luck fucker it really fucking sucks and then like you know you want to honor the pre-order you've made or whatever or, you, or the, 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 the like my lgs doesn't even ask for money up front, they just like, okay, you know, we know you'll want this when it comes in. Um, because I've, I've known them for years. But like, then I'm like, okay, well, they haven't got 1.5. That's not their fault. But like, I, oh, fuck, I don't know why. but I need, I want 1.5 right now. So I'm going to go to a different store. And then I'm like, well, I'm not going to fucking shaft my LGS. So I'm also going to have to buy when they eventually get 1.5. I'm going to have to buy 1.5 off them as well. Just randomly made the Jogress of Volcanic Drum on Hexablaumon. They added new Digimon for, um, for Hexablaumon. There's, a, there's two new Digimon on that set. Three new Digimon? Three new Digimon on that dim card. On the uh, Lucamon dim. So it's possible. Although I think we would have seen it by now. Wonder what the Metal Empire dim will have for a new Digimon. I mean, it's not necessarily gra guaranteed they're going to have new Digimon, right? Digimon and Gabumon have all got existing Digimon. Uh, there was a question mark on... Uh, um, ancient warriors that just turned out to be Imperial Digimon Dragon Mode, so it's not guaranteed that it's like new Digimon. 
I, I am really looking forward. Uh, Great Legend, I'm honestly going to get like one UK box, well, one global box. That's all I care about. Uh, Battle of Omni, I'm going to be buying a bunch of those boxes at global. That is the set that like... For content, it's the best. It's the best because it's like full of Omnimon and full of cards I love. And then Battle... Great Legend's fine, but it's just like... It's like, unless you get Lucimon or the Lucimon alt, it's just like, mm. Lucimon and Chaosmon are definitely, like, the standouts of that box, like, pull-wise, like, art-wise and stuff. But Great Legend in general just felt, like, less impressive. Did market as a new Metal Empire? Yeah, it's definitely possible, for sure. For sure. Um, I wouldn't be surprised at all if there were new Digimon on there. I'm just going to keep buying Dim, though. I've got all of the ones. Oh, we're getting raided by Digital Hazard? What's up, Digital Hazard? Welcome. I know you. I recognize that name. Welcome. How's it going, buddy? Speaking of Gilmon, we got Grandmon on screen. How you living? We have adjust him on. They have had a suspicious um, absence of tamers stuff there's like renamon and gilmon and stuff so far but they haven't had like tamers tamers <laughs> or anything like that so far so i would maybe hazard a guess to say either double diamond or the set after it might have a lot of tamers stuff uh, including uh justimon so we've got monodramon already but we haven't got we got cyber i feel like we haven't got cyber or Strike Dramon. We might have Strike Dramon. I don't know if we've got Strike Dramon. I could be wrong. It was weird to me that they did like the Adventure Tamers and the Zero Two Tamers and then the Savers Tamers during the Frontier set. That was a weird one. And then now, then they did like the Cyber Sleuth Tamers. It's a weird bag of how they're doing them. Like, I'm kind of glad that the sets aren't like, here's the Zero Two set, here's the Tamers set, but it does feel weird when they specifically introduce like the Frontier Spirit Evolution mechanic to not have Takuya. At least Takuya, you know? How the fuck did I get that purple to activate before? How did I get that to work? Hey, Nokia's crazy. Red. Oh, blue. No, I thought the gate was giving it away, but it wasn't. We said that tamer combo with the hybrid evolved Digimon. I mean, it would be nice. There, there's a there's a tie I think that does some interesting shit. But yeah, ultimate. Oh my god. Hey, this game. I'm not doing an LP of this. I'm sorry. You have to have both doors open. But they don't. Okay, maybe I'm just stupid. I like Nokia in the games. The card is nasty. Bias of Omega is like hilarious and something that I make fun of people for saying. But also, like, holy shit, Bias of Omega. Fuck me. I'm on DB vibing. Go Palmon. Palmon looking kind of thick as well. Made her a little chungy. Go hype for Justimon. At least we're getting a Justimon dim. I'm probably going to go full Rio. Like Nokia, but she was more main character. Yeah, the, the main criticism I have of Cyber Sleuth so far. Um into what chapter 7 or wherever I got up to is just that the characters are just so Mary Sue not even Mary Sue just blank slates like you may as well not be there you are a tool other people use Lockmon and Dorimon I think I think we're pretty likely to get a second set of Gashapon the Tamers so that would be like Terriamon Lopmon, Hagurumon uh, Marine Angemon and Leomon, maybe? 
Glitch being a bitch and not letting you resub. God damn it. If we hit that sub goal, I'm going to buy that dinosaur costume, by the way. Okay, so red is open. Then I do blue. And red closes. Do blue again. Red opens. Do red. Red closes. How do I get them both open? Mojo 1 was done harsh in the dim. Three megas. Yeah. A lot of them, it's more mode changes. Like, some of them get, like, their variants. Like, Sakuyamon gets her variant. But I think uh, Gallantmon's kind of the same. I think you got, like, Gallantmon, Gallantmon Paladin mode, whatever the fuck it's called. And then, is it Chaos Gallantmon? Something like that. All of their megas are kind of, like, mm. They are more, like, mode changes than outright branching paths, even though, yeah, they're variants, blah, 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 but... Medieval Gallantmon? Yeah, that's the one. No, not Crimson. I think Crimson Mode is on there as well, but yeah, Medieval Gallantmon was the one I'm thinking of. I am so confused by this puzzle. Chaos Gallant? Okay. What's up now? Red, but... I can't tell if that's supposed to tell me something or not. Okay, that's open. Right, that just seemed random, but okay. Okay. Now red? Uh, medieval Gallantmon would be an ultra level Digimon for Gallantmon. You'd think, not in the VB. Not in the VB. Alright, let's try it. Did you sell charge? Wait, you on your pre-order version 1.0 booster box? God damn. That's a while. <laughs> December, January, February, March, April, May. No, April. So five months? Jesus. What's up, cultist? Welcome. Red Gilmon and Black Gilmon. Right, it seems weird. I mean, they're Gashapon. So that makes sense. They're a lot cheaper. They're well, not a lot cheaper. A little bit cheaper than the regular uh, dim releases, but still. Play the trial cards and the Gashapon and stuff. It's just like, eh, I mean, it's nice. You know, I get to put, you know, Justimon into my into my bank without worrying, but I would like a little bit more choice. But then again, I've got a lot of choice with the other dim cards, so, you know. Yeah! It's whatever. I'm more grossed out by the Gashapon P Bandai. It's just, it's such a, it's like a, an oxymoron. I'm not convinced he isn't a JoJo character, honestly. Yada yada, does he? What are we gonna get? Uh oh. Back to GeoGreymon, sure. Why the fuck not? Oh no, regular Greymon. Oh, cool. Oh, nice. That's pretty sweet. I hid Gashapon and went, oh no, then I hid by Bandai and went, oh no! Yeah, it's like the worst of both worlds, man. At least apparently it tells you what you get when you pre-order. So it, it could be worse. It could be worse. It could be an on-arrival thing, which would suck real bad. Okay, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna try... No! I don't understand what this is. Am I like waiting for a... Okay, I, I see the light, but it doesn't seem to fucking correspond to anything. I, I don't understand this.
I love Digimon. I like this stream. I'd like it even more if I had actual signal. Could watch the video instead of spam chat. I'm sorry, cultist. Twitch, uh, Twitch seems a little bit fucky with people's internet. It needs a more stable connection, it seems, than YouTube. I don't want to start doing game streams on YouTube again. Twitch is where I do the majority of my gaming, and YouTube is where I do unboxings and live reactions and stuff like that, I guess. Oh, Ty versus Matt, for real. With assistance from Lalamon. Nobody asked Lalamon. Kind of cool that you can get OG Greymon. Thanks for the follow, Cultist. Appreciate you. Might have to pull up a guide, because I'm genuinely... Genuinely confuzzled. You mean face doesn't match? Bitch. Digimon. World. Data Squad. Walk through. Lalamon's dead? Good. It's what she deserves. I just don't get this puzzle at all. You okay? Love the Tanemon card that is Digimon World 1 reference. Yeah, it's super good. Super good. Uh, Shoto Forest. That was easy. Right, I'm gonna find it now and it's gonna be like so easy. Okay, come on. No, that's not it. Okay. No. Oh, this guide is scuffed too. The Digi Wrap? Oh my god, hold on. The Digi Volution is up and running. Did you see? Did you hear? Did you know it was coming? Digi Destiny starts today. Let me hear you say Digimon, Digimon. Digital monsters, Digimon are the champions. Digimon, digital monsters, Digimon are the champions. With Digi Fort. With Digi Will and Digi Vice Saint Hand, there's a Digi Dynamic Force and Digi Lane with the Digi Press and Digi Present Collide. It's time to Digi Size Digimon. <sighs> he doesn't know the Digi Rap for real. Okay. What the fuck? Okay. Right. There's Red Sphere 1. I, I... Right, I think I have to reset it. Because evidently this shit ain't happening. I wish I could turn off random battles for a minute. Just for a minute. We need to touch Red Sphere 1, then the Red Barrier to the south. Only ever owned five Digimon games. Battle Spirit 1, 2, World Data Squad, and both side of games. I've owned quite a few, but I've barely played any. Games are bullshit. Fucking bullshit. Guys have a fuck with the iron cheek. Right into your big beefy super Digimon. Whoops, turn my monitor off again. Eat touch screen sometimes. Anyone over the own the uh, Xbox S? I can able to digivolve Lalamon. Nice, I should probably actually heal Lalamon as well. Uh, do, 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 do. Yeah, let's do that. Lalamon Galaxy. I have to do it in battle first. Yes, seems I do. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We'll live. I need to go back round. Talk to homeboy. Oh. 
we have had the Rosemond discussion. I'm not a huge fan either. It's fine. I like Rosemond enough. It's just not anything like crazy for me. Okay, I should have been doing Whoops. Next battle. Next battle. If I can just clear this forest, I'll feel good about ending the stream. But for right now, I don't feel good about ending the stream. Grew up with one and two, didn't get the other games until way later. Yeah, I mean, I had them, um, but I didn't play a ton of them. What? Is that it? I was just always, I was really put off by World 1, and then I think I just got tainted to Digimon games going forward. Yeah, four's not bad. Kazuna made it extremely easy to cosplay as Davis. And then just like, same with Ken, right? It's just like a black t-shirt and black jeans. Yeah. I'm speeding up too when I actually had a copy of Deus Squad for a while. Nice. Yes. Fine, it's fine. I'm just mashing X to get through these battles. I think I talk to Salomon and get an egg. Oh, I fucking hate this game, dude. It takes so long to get into a battle as well. It takes so long. It's the worst. I like how Yoshino doesn't fight a Digimon. <laughs> He's just normal. Going to Sunflowermon? Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we living? Patamon. Okay, sure. But no, Sukaimon. Alright, sure, man. Sukaimon versus Patamon. Let's go. Friendly fire, literally. Literally. If I could just turn off random encounters for a bit, that would be fucking Daijobu. That was easy! Amon vs. Sukaimon, Hope vs. Despair, pretty much. Does it say angry above Agumon? I don't know. I didn't tell you. What I could tell you is that just randomly spooned off to the left for a minute. Strange. I just wish I could. Oh, the random encounters in this game. No, I'm not doing a full LP of this. I can't fucking stand it anymore. This sucks, dude. Having to go through that whole thing every time. So... Let's get out of here. It takes so long to get in and out of. Okay then, okay then, okay, 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 cool. Listen, this is all on you too. It's not just me, all right? It's all on you guys too. <laughs> Ooh. That's a low moment. That's that's a that's a clip. First of all, second of all, 
Oh, oh, boy. I'm going to have to get DPST to edit this stream now. Fuck. God fucking damn it, dude. What is wrong with me? What's wrong with all of us? Someone should have pointed that out by now. I'm going to deflect blame. <laughs> oh my, oh my God, dude. I don't need your help. Wow. I solved it like 20 minutes ago. Yeah, no, I'm I'm just deflecting Skyhawk. It's mostly on me. I solved it like 20 minutes ago. And I I just thought I couldn't get there. In my defense, it didn't look like an engine. Let's do it, Galmon. Attack pattern A. Pokemon waited for so long. It lost all its energy. These are Commander Samson's orders. I was I was actually doing like you do to the uh, to the pain. Is it the pain in MGS3? Is that the name of the old guy? No, not the pain. The old guy anyway in MGS3. I think it is the pain. The old guy who dies if you just don't play the game for ages. <laughs> oh god, I'm so stupid. I'm so unbelievably thick. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, fuck me, man. What a fucking idiot. You should call this clip Khan is a fucking idiot. Khan is a, Khan is a fool. Khan is a real jabro- Khan is a jabroni. A digibroni. No, not a digibroni. Nope, that's a whole different thing. Call it whatever you want. <laughs> The end, that's it. The pain is the B guy. Yeah! I thought that was wrong. I thought it was wrong. I knew I was wrong saying the pain. Okay, just call the clip the clip F. Evolution! Dreamon! Digivolve! Vimon. Dorimon, okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Not gonna be as strong, but I'll take it. Oh, it is strong. <laughs> okay, cool. Just break the chain. Pretty strong. Dash metal. Dark hand. Uh oh. He's flying. Oh yeah, he is flying. The little wings. Rolling up her! Rolling up her! I don't know, dude. He just he just vibing, you know. Rip 20 minutes, thank you so much. Enjoy your fairy dragon. Yeah, I don't mind the Doraemon model. It's actually pretty good. Not too bad. One of the stronger models in the game. Thank you so much for the clip, Crimson, Crimson Dragon Slayer. Someone should probably tell Zenkai to put that on the uh, car no contest. <laughs> Fuck me. What is wrong with me, man? So stupid. At least it's not the X Evolution model. Yeah. Oh no, the Doraemon model in X Evolution isn't too bad. It's it's like the Andromon model that's super scuffed in X Evolution. Oh, Gamon turned back into an egg. Oh well. I guess your Digimon isn't that good. Hi, Thomas. Pussy. That one's my favorite Saber's Digimon partner. But for the purpose of the meme, he's a fucking pussy. Oh, get on, Bakemon, you died, idiot. What did you die, you fool, you moron? Now that I know that I'm just an idiot, maybe I will full LP this game. <laughs> we did it! <laughs> Not quite. Such a flip-flopping little whore, aren't I? God damn. Uh-oh. The Digivolution is up and running. Did you see? Did you hear? Did you know it was coming? Digi Destiny starts today. Let me hear you say. All the way to my outer spawn, huh? You really want that? Okay. All right. All right. Bet. All right. Hey, I was a fucking Dorymon. That's not correct. And he was an egg. A bit of 
fucking consistent. And that was a fucking Sukaimon. Bit of, bit of consistency, please. I know where to cut scene. Shut up. This'll be fun. This'll be fun. <laughs> Pretty fucking cool, dude. Attacks with BB attributes, virus busters are effective. BB on attributes. Who are you? It's like they knew. It doesn't matter. You need to. Oh, that's gonna be Yuma's BB brother, BB huh? Interesting. My Otismon's attributes are NSO, Nightmare Soldiers. So his weakness is BB attributes. Okay. If we support our Digimon attacks with BB enchant. We can win this according to my calculation. Oh okay. boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's break the chain. Just Storymon, huh? Nightmare Wave! Oh no, we're back. We're in command. Um, I guess I will use an item on... I got lots of HP charge. I'm gonna... Oh, uh, fuck off. Do that on Doraemon. And then I might, I might use a KHP on Gaumon next. Virus Buster! I don't have the. Oh yeah, VB Enchant, there we go. VB Enchant! Oh yeah, dude. This is the first time I've seen the virus buster and other stuff actually affect things. Yeah, I think so, right? Normally they just go by like virus data vaccine rather than like nightmare soldiers. Um, you still charge? See what happens. See if he digivolves. Just break the chain. Break the chain is so good, by the way. No matter what people say about Digimon Adventure 2020, the soundtrack, the OST, oh. Every song a banger, man. To various extents, but every song a banger. Gogamon, we move. Gogamon. You don't have VB, huh? Interesting. Uh, I guess we'll go to home. I guess we'll action. It's regular action. See what you want to do the most. Go to home. Go Cool. And this is my Osmon guys. Plus, I might try and Digi Soul Dorimon. They break the chain. I think of the opening to Kiva. Yeah, that is also a break the chain song. You're not wrong. Should probably go to champion. Oh, critical, nice. Can Dorimon have a turn now? No? Okay, sure. Just do whatever makes sense to you. Alright, not great damage, but you know. Alright, so I'm gonna use the metal cannon. And then. Hopefully next turn I'll get some Digi Soul and I can Digivolve. Oh, that does hella damage when you VB enchant. Okay. Okay. And you can't, huh? You can just N and I guess I can NSP enchant. Won't really do anything, but maybe it'll make him slightly stronger. Power up! Okay, we'll see. Good at the punch. Uh, Iris God, sure. Compliment. You should be okay now. Yeah, I guess. Not sure that was the best move, but we'll go. We'll go with it. I think the only time outside of VPS stuff that Virus stuff comes up is Digimon Next. 
Well, no digital roll. Okay, Nat Tardy. I want to see if the VB stays or if I do it every other round. I'm assuming it's going to be every other round, but we'll see. Oh no, it seems to be decent damage still. Let's break the chain. Okay, we're going to fuck my Otis Mon up. No worries, no dramas. No dramas at all. We got it. Yeah, you can blood punch all you- Oh, that's terrible damage, you pussy! Are you a pussy? Hey! Crimson Dragon Slayer with a th Second year of subs! 13 months in a row, you legend! Thank you so much! You're a real one. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. You're the realest and the trillest. We fucked up my Atlas Mon. It's a great day to be Khan. Apart from that huge fuck up. Yeah, once we end this forest, I'm gonna end the stream. Should be after this fight. Yeah! Oh, that. I'm gonna see if I can. I might put it to 4x3 for the next stream and hopefully that'll fix the shadows issue. But I might try and see if I can do that at the end of the stream. Just a quick test. I won't end you, Richard. We have confirmed that the target Digimon has turned back into a Digi egg. Yay! I would never end you, Rico. Rico from Starship Troopers. I would never. Good job. Um, who is okay, Dick. I should have done How'd you get Dick from Richard? <laughs> Roto's tweet? What did he tweet? So it's did he tweet? Hold on, I'll tell you what, we'll do all that at the end. We'll do all that at the end. Thomas! Thomas, who is this? Nice to meet you, Yoshi. Oh, hey, Kagura. This is Sukata Kagura. Oh. He's been transferred to the Dash. They're talking so today. fast. I look forward to working with you. Didn't notice. So was Kagura Thomas a senior at Stockholm Royal? I was his senior, but I'm no match for Thomas. Okay. Thomas is a genius that graduated at the head of his class when he was 13. So what's someone like you doing in Japan? Well, what's someone called Kagura doing in Japan? Something to do with I wonder. Occurrences? What's this dark area about? It's a dark area in the digital world. I've heard about it. It's a mysterious area even in the digital world. I don't get it. If I have to figure out what the dark area is, I see. Wait a second. Are you saying I'm not smart enough to understand? <laughs> now, now. <laughs> anyway, it appears that the whole digital world is affected when the dark area. Right. It seems that the strange occurrences in the digital world are connected to the real world. So the dark area has something to do with the missing children and the digital. Mm. I've been called in to investigate since I'm an expert on the dark area. Isn't Marcus the same voice actor as Raiden? What, Quentin Flynn? Is that Raiden? I don't know. I might be wrong on that. So I don't know voice is Raiden. Okay, you can stop talking now. Thank you. There's more to it than that, right, Kagura? Uh-oh. What about it? Maybe. I don't know. She's one of the missing children. Her name is... He also voiced um, Reno and Axel, but I think he's um, got into some hot water recently. Yes. You might as my sister. Uh oh. The sister gun die, homie. As you can see, I have a personal stake in this mission. I've got to get to the bottom of it. Is everybody here? A huge Digimon signature was. Oh, yeah, a huge a Digimon, Digimon signature. signature. Let's go. Wait, can I save, please? Okay. And that's going to be it for this installment of Data Squad. Apparently, Proto tweeted something, so now I need to find out what the fuck he tweeted. So I can call him out live on air. Alright, cool. Ah! Sorry about that. Hit the mic. Hello, everybody. Thank you for watching the stream, I appreciate it. This game isn't that bad. Pretty enjoyable. I feel like a uh, great idiot. Or, uh, let me just save state as well. I'll see if I can get the save state slot zero. Slot one. Cool. 
Uh, let's go see what Proto tweeted, and then we'll get out of here. Let's break the chain. Do do do. Twitter. No, nope, not Twitter. Apparently, not allowed on Twitter. Hey, right, can I go on Twitter, please? Yeah. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, it's oh, of course it signed me out. Shit. That's fine. Sign myself out of all devices because I was paranoid. Um, someone had hacked my account. They hadn't. I just thought on the off chance. Or the proto tweet. Oh. Oh, it was in the Cyber Sleuth LP? Tremendous. 320 shy of getting 10k friendship points. What can you redeem with 10k friendship points? Oh, a dare or a truth? Jesus. I mean, I still have right to refuse on really, like, fucked up shit, by the way. Like, I'm not just gonna... You can do a different one. If it's like, hey, tell the truth about, like, this person. I have the right to say no. <laughs> oh, yeah. Shoutouts to the memory up moment. All right, that's gonna be it for today. Um, I might be back next week with more Data Squad. I think it's a more streamable game than the than the rest. Um, I do want to get back to Tag Tamers at some point, but tomorrow I'll be live uh, because we're doing um the Among Us airship, the new map which came out the other day. Uh, so we'll be we'll be doing that tomorrow, hopefully, if all goes to plan. Yeah, it looks wild. It looks wild. I'm very excited. Um, but we've got some people to thank, and then I'm going to get my fat ass out of here. So, three wins in a row playing with randoms, nice. Uh, shouts to do, 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 do. Lucifer, Psycho, Streases, uh, Jace, Dean, Lena for the follows, Crimson Dragon Slayer for the host, uh, Zella for the follow, Kasai. Phantom, Caspian, and Thousa for the follow. Digital Hazard for the raid. Cultist for the follow. And Crimson Dragon Slayer for that 13 month primary sub. What a king. Hero clicks. Man, I used to fuck with hero clicks. When the Khan is sus. <laughs> Alright, anybody. Anybody. Okay, anybody. <laughs> Alright, everybody. Uh, I will be back tomorrow with Among Us, and then I'll be taking a couple of days off to work on videos. But until then, I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Be kind to each other. Keep washing your hands, all that shit. We're coming out of this bitch, but it's not over yet. Until next time. I'll see you when we go digital. <laughs>